Hi. Hey, what's going on? What are you doing? I literally just hit record. Oh, you <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome to today's video. So today I'm trying a product out that one of you guys had suggested I try. So I did see this video um, on YouTube already on Dominique, and I'm, I don't wanna say her name wrong. Dominique Sash, S-A-C-H-S-E. I hope I said it right. Um, but I did see her use it, um, cause I do follow her. And um, someone else, one of you guys had seen the same video and said, oh, you should try this product. I said, you know, you know, I would, I'll, I'll try it, why not? And the product is called Wow Color Wow. I mean, is that not like the coolest bottle? So when I went on, she straightens her hair. So she got this um, product, it's a spray, and it makes your hair like extremely anti-humidity, like there's no, no humidity is getting in, it's supposed to be silky smooth. So when I went on to get, I'm like, oh, yeah, try my, I'll have to straighten my hair. Um, so I went on there, and then when I went on there to buy that, I saw this one. Different. I saw this one, and this one is called Dream Coat for Curly Hair. <gasps> so it creates the perfect frizz-free curls. So I thought, well, why don't I get both? I know, I'm spending so much money. But you know what? Because this, um, the curly hair one is, the curly hair one's $24. And the straightener one is $28. So, this better be good. <laughs> That's all I'm gonna say. But I was curious, I really wanted to try the curly one. Like, of course, like, I'm more of a curly haired girl. I think she straightens her hair a lot. She has curly hair, but she straightens it more. I like my curls, so I leave my hair curly more. So I thought, I have to try this. So I'm very curious. And um, yeah, so let's get into this. Actually, so today, so I am gonna do another video. Um, am I gonna do it next week, a couple weeks? It will come in within the next week or two of me using the spray and straightening my hair and seeing how that looks. But today I'm gonna go in and use the curly hair one. So, it says in the back, weightless, weightless moisturizing spray does all the combined work of outdated overweight, overweight is in quotes, curl formulas. This light spray replaces sticky gels, slimy serums, and heavy creams. Just spray and air dry for perfect bundled frizz free curls. So much better than natural, they're super natural, wow. Okay, so definitely get the sticky gels. Hate sticky gels. Slimy serums, I get that, it's like oily. Heavy creams. Um, the only thing with the heavy creams, like sometimes I want the heaviness when my hair is puffy, like it kind of pulls it down. But let's see, I'm excited to try this. Um, okay. All right, so let me get my hair ready. Okay, hair is out and ready to get the stuff put in. I've been doing my I've been um, finger twirling my hair again when I style it because I was getting better curl results. So I'll do that again today. Oh, wait a minute. This Oh, this is a spray. What am I doing? Let's start over. I forgot. It's a spray. So it comes out like a spray. Literally. Let's see if you can see this. So... That comes out like a spray, so I'm gonna spray it in my hair, and I don't know, like I'm a little concerned that this isn't gonna be enough for my hair, so I'm really curious. Okay, to the other side, and then I'll go back and kind of make sure it's an old head. Definitely not gonna be heavy, I can tell you that, like a cream. Like, how do I know if I have enough? Okay, so maybe I'll just kinda go in with my hands and make sure it's worked through my hair. I feel like I put a lot on. So, again, like I said, I've been kinda going back to the, um, just throwing some of, I do it really quick, cause you know, I'm always in a hurry. Just like 
literally, I don't take my time unless I have time because I'm going somewhere. But I'm literally doing this like really quick just to get some curls. So I'm trying to grow my hair out, not like I used to have. I don't want my hair that long again, but just like, you know, like a little over here, but I want this part to grow out more and kind of even out now. Like it, this used to be a lot shorter. So I actually, I cut my hair a little. Just like literally on the bottom here because the back grows so much quicker than the front and I guess that's because it's on the bottom part of my head as opposed to the top of my head, I don't know. But um, I didn't like those extra, that longer in the back pieces that were showing so I just cut it to even it out. So hopefully it'll start growing together more. Um, again, I'm just doing this quickly, I'm not doing really it works. Uh, I can't tell if I haven't, if this is going to be enough product for my hair because again, I have really coarse hair and dry hair. I hope it does. hope it works. For the price at least. If anything else, I don't feel like it's enough in my hair, but I guess we're going to find out, right? Okay, I'm gonna go dry my hair and let's see how this came out. I'll be right back. I'm back. I styled my hair, I dried it, and I gotta tell you, I don't look in the mirror when I style my hair. I just style it and as I'm, I can usually tell while I'm touching my hair what, after I'm crunching it out to dry if I'm gonna like a product or not, or what I'm thinking about the product. Is it gonna be this or that? And I was just feeling my hair after it dried because it dried so fast because it's like I felt like I put water in my hair and I'm like there's no way this is gonna hold my curl there's no way and it dried so fast I'm like of course because it's not a heavy product and then I'm feeling it and I'm like well it feels like my actually my texture doesn't feel thick it almost felt like when I did my keratin like my texture felt like I'm like all right but there's no way it's too light of a product let me tell you something, when I looked in the mirror, I was like, what? This like really came out good for a product that felt like water is in my hair. Like they're not kidding and my hair feels light. Like it really feels light. It's almost like I said when I got the keratin done. Like it literally, I feel like changed my texture in a good way, in a great way. Um, hold on one second. So someone wanted to come in. She was sniffing under the door. Do you like my curly hair? You have curly hair too. Maybe we should put, put in your hair. No, you, you don't need anything. You're too beautiful. Okay, mommy's gotta, mommy's gotta finish filming, okay? There's no food up here. That's all you care about. Okay, so yeah, like I am like, <laughs> bless you, pleasantly surprised at how this worked. I'm amazed. I'm really like amazed. And if I'm amazed at how it feels, it really feels like wow. It feels like my hair got thinner even, which is what I I want for my hair. Um I just I, I just can't believe I think it's a really amazing product. It really is. So definitely worth the money that I spent on this for sure. Um definitely worth it. Love it. And as I said, I'm going to do a video um, either next week or the week after of the um, spray and blowing it out. Actually, by the way, my hair feels soft too, by the way. For curls, this product is wow. Exactly what the product is called. Wow. Really, really, really good. Very impressed. Love it. Hey guys. So I just want to interrupt for one second because I didn't get to come on at the end of that day 
from using the product because at the end of the night, I didn't feel that my hair looked good. It kind of got frizzy. I lost the curls. I don't know. It was just like a frizzier look for me. So I said, let me try this again. And I tried it today. I tried it this morning. It's now, I'm home from work. So it's, you know, almost 8, 8 p.m. And I got to tell you that um, I didn't like the way my hair looked all day. So never mind that it didn't look, I just felt like it didn't look good even from the get-go. Whereas in the video, when I first tried it, I thought my hair looked great. And then like a few hours later, it started to look how it looks now, which in my opinion is frizzy. Maybe you're not thinking it's frizzy, but for me, like you know your hair, you know? You know when your hair is could be nicer. Like I just don't feel like my curls are as nice as, I feel like I've been getting nice curls lately with a few of the, the last products that I've been testing and using. And I kind of, I'm now back to where I was feeling how I was worried the first time when I felt the consistency that is like just watery. It's literally as if I was putting water on and I was, I was concerned because of my hair texture and type. I will say though, I think this is a great product if your hair is not dry and coarse as mine is. And even though, again, I'm going to repeat it again, but I still have a little keratin in my hair, so normally it's even more dry, more coarse. I just think that for me personally, for my hair texture, not so much the curls, but the texture of my hair, if you have dry, thick, puffy, uh, coarse hair, this might not be the best product. I need a product that is moisturizing, literally like a lotion, um, so that's why I use creams, because I feel... I can feel the cream in my curls and as I'm trying to like twirl my curls it's like I, I just like you know how the curl the cream will like kind of like get the the curls will kind of just get together and then curl how can I do this like my fingers curl together and then they'll stay like that because the cream will keep it like that but with this consistency of a product it's like water there's not it's not it's not going to stay you know what I'm saying? I don't know if I'm explaining it that right good, but um, I need a cream base. So I'm not, I don't want to say that this is not a great product because again, my hair looked good yesterday. So I was confused why it didn't at least look good the first couple hours like it did the first day. So I guess it's a hit or miss. I'm going to keep trying it. And I guess like this is why I like to do the quarterly reviews because I go back on all the products that I used and I'll show you the ones that worked out for me and that I keep using. So um, I'm going to continue to use this and you know it's like a science project. You have to do it like a, a bunch of times and then see were there more times good, more times bad, how it works out. Could, and it was a nice day. It wasn't like a rainy day or anything. So I don't know. Like I don't like the way my hair looks right now. I know that I can get better curls with other products. So that being said. Um, I don't know if I'm going to give it a thumbs up or not, to be honest. I don't know. Because again, good day, bad day. The end of the night, didn't like my hair when I did the, the video you just saw. that, And I didn't have time to get back on, the, on, uh, on here to show it to you, so I apologize. But anyway, long story short, I'm going to keep trying it. Um, you know, and the price is in the 20s, so I don't know. It's up to you if you want to try it or not. I am going to try the straightening one next um, on another video, so we'll see. Maybe that'll be better. I don't know. We'll see. Um, but that's it. So I guess I'll end this um, video now. I had an ending for yesterday when I filmed it, but I'll just end it now and say um, I'll keep you posted on this product. and. I hope you um, got something out of it. I don't know. If you tried it, let me know. Let me know if you like it below or if you don't like it, what you think. And what kind of, if you did try it, let me know the texture of your hair. Because I do think that if your hair is thinner, not as drying, and not coarse, that this will be a great product for your curls. I really do think that. So um, that's it. I hope you enjoyed today's video. And please give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe below if you haven't. And until next time, have a great day.